seems to be the same as yesterday. I look forward to new experiences every time as I journey through my basic military training. Some chapters are tougher than the rest, Isaac. but these memories I'll cherish forever. We are Dragon Company, and this is our story. Our story of every Singaporean son. Go to and go to the mic. So you continue to straight to the camera, okay? And then tell us who you are and how are you this year. Wait, ah, the moment. So I'm Isaac, I'm 19 this year. I'm gonna be enlisted on 4th April. Yeah, it should be fine. Good fact, because we got hair. I will go through with you. Okay? Please rise for your oath taking. Stand up! I'm a bit worried about entering NS because of the uncertainties. When I'm at home, I would usually inform my parents if I am going out instead of asking if I could go out. I need to pack an alarm clock, basic toiletries, clothes and washing powder. Bring along your alarm clock. Remember to set... No, this one is this one. Bring along some shit. About 30 years ago, I also went to Tekong. I'm very excited that Isaac is also going to the army. Anything you miss out? To prepare Isaac for the army, actually I also purchased a picky powder for him to keep himself dry and cool, especially when he's out in the field. There's a few days that he may not have a chance to bath. This picky powder will help him. After we landed on Tekong, within the next 15 minutes, we were prepared for our Oath of Allegiance and for the speech by the CCT. I need you to be loud. I need you to answer with gusto. Understood? Yes. Good. So during the equipping session, there was one person in front and the sergeant told him to raise up the item to check. I repeat again, your boots, make sure it's not too tight. Okay, make sure your toes are not touching at the edge of your boots. Isaac, the purpose of this interview is to get to know yourself better in terms of your problems and whatever you want to disclose right now. So these are a few things that I need to let you know before anything. Uh. So, you know what's AWOL? Okay, absent without audit. So something like when you're supposed to report to camp, like then you disappear, like you are missing without a trace. So that's chargeable offense. I don't have the money now. Can I pay you back with you? No, I just pay you. I think it's quite a different feel. Now it's quite nice to touch my head. <laughs> I guess for army it's, it's okay, but maybe when I go out to society, I'll look like the odd one out, so it will make me feel a bit like an outcast. Okay, not like an outcast, not like that. Make me feel that I'm out of the fashion trend. Video call, just call you lah. Semua orang tak video call lah, malam pun putus lah, tengok. 
Tekong isn't what I expected. I expected a lot of people running around shouting, you know, that kind of stuff. But in the end, all of it was done in an orderly manner. There was, there was order, there was management. Everything was pretty smooth sailing from where we left the ferry to how we entered the, the, the island. Uh, just now I eat like, uh, chicken rice, uh, chayam. So to me, the food was actually quite decent. I expected it to be worse, but yeah, it's, it's still edible. And I, I, I think I actually uh, enjoyed it, yeah. It was comparable to what I had at home or outside, yeah. For, for me, like, at least.